Yes. Were you together when she got pregnant? No. So her pregnancy was not an agreement you entered into together, correct? No. It was an agreement she entered into with Dr. Mark Sloan, correct? They agreed after the fact, but yes, Mark was Sophia's father. Callie and I were together. We were a couple before the pregnancy and then after Sophia was conceived. So you became part of the parenting plan later, correct? Just to be clear, Dr. Sloan and Dr. Torres were Sophia's parents, and then you came around. No, I didn't come around. I'm Sophia's mother. I illegally adopted her. She didn't want to go there. No, she doesn't. Her last names are Sloan and Torres. I'm going to have to stop you before you continue for your own sake. You're not going to imply that I'm any less Sophia's mother because we don't share the same DNA. Dr. Robbins, excuse me. Because that would be offensive. It would be offensive to anyone in the room who has an adopted child or is an adopted child. And for you to say that, I Dr. chose Robbins. to be Sophia's mother. It did not fall into my lap. There was a choice and I could stay or I could run and I chose motherhood. And it was the best choice that I ever made. I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm a doctor and I, I have to answer my phone. So I'm sorry. I'm, I'm so sorry. Thank you. <sighs> Someone more important to me? Actually, yes. Excuse me? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. <sighs> I love my child. And I want her with me, but I know that no matter how this ends, she'll survive. <laughs> she'll be healthy and safe and well taken care of and loved because we are her mothers. But there's a child at the hospital who will not survive unless I am there, so.